In this section, we're going to talk about percentage of profit and loss. The formula that we use to calculate that is what we call made over paid. Let's take a look at a question. This question says the two 100-foot lots were purchased for $20,000 each. The two lots were then divided into three lots and sold for $250 per front foot. Question asks you, what is the percentage of profit? Keep in mind the percentage of profit is always a percentage of what was paid for the property, not what the property sold for. Obviously, you need to know what it sold for to calculate it, but the percentage is always a percentage of what was paid. In this case, we use the formula made over paid, and that equals, again, the percentage of profit or loss. In this case, the person purchased two 100-foot lots for $20,000 each. So if we simply take two, doesn't matter how big they were, but two times $20,000 tells us that they paid $40,000 for these lots. They then sold them for $250 per front foot. This is where the measurement is important. We know that they were 100 feet each. So 200 feet times $250 per front foot, this lot, this property sold for $50,000. So they paid $40,000. They sold it for $50,000, which means they made $10,000. We now put that in the calculator, made over paid, $10,000 divided by $40,000. And we find that this particular transaction, these people incurred a 25% profit. Again, if you work this backwards, 25% of the 40,000 they paid would be their profit, which is $10,000. Just an easy way to check yourself. Let's do one more. This question says that three 60 by 80 foot lots were purchased for $7.50 per square foot. The lots were later sold for $60,000 each. What was the percentage of profit? Same as the last question, made over paid gives us our percentage of profit or loss. In this case, they paid 108,000, which is 60, by 80 is the measurements, times $7.50 uh, $7 per square foot, times three lots, totals $108,000. They sold three lots for $60,000 each. So three times 60,000 gives us a sales price of 180,000. If we subtract the purchase price from the sales price, we will find that they made a $72,000 profit. Again, 180,000 minus 108 gives us a $72,000 profit. Plug this into your made over paid formula, 72,000 divided by the purchase price or what they paid, which was 108, tells us that these particular people incurred a 67% profit when they did this subdivision and sold these lots.